call home and we have a terrific leader who is getting us there. You've heard from him, those of you who've been here in the past, he has all sorts of cool graphics and moving dots and charts and he's a, he's a math guy, he's a numbers guy, I am not. But I always look forward to hearing how our district is doing. He's been your superintendent, this is your 10th year now, starting number 10, is that right? 11. Time flies when you're having fun. Your 2011 Superintendent of the Year for the State of Kansas, a national finalist. Please say hello to Dr. Tom Trigg. Thank you, Tom. Appreciate it. Well, good morning, and thank you so much uh, for being here. The support that you provide us um, is immeasurable. It, it, it absolutely is. To be able to fill this, this ballroom with over 1,100 people supporting the kids in Blue Valley sends a message that just resonates, quite frankly, throughout the entire organization. So thank you so much for being a part of this. 24 years, next year celebrating 25 years for our Educational Foundation, a phenomenal, phenomenal accomplishment. We're gonna piggyback on that next year at the breakfast because the Blue Valley School District is going to be celebrating its 50th year. So we're gonna have a dual 25, 50 year celebration. So mark your calendars, was it the 27th that I saw of August? So go ahead and mark your calendars right now for next year. We'd love to have you back and celebrate with us. Hey, I am. Um, I know we've already recognized these people, but I wanted to recognize them personally because Laura and Cindy and Ann do such a tremendous job of putting this event together. The behind the scenes work that goes on, um, I don't think any of us can really imagine. So one more time, let's thank our Educational Foundation staff and our volunteers. We like to highlight um, some of the grants that the foundation gives, and, and you've seen the broadcast studios, and they mentioned the Maker Fair that was out uh, in the forum for four year. But there were two other um, two other exhibits going on out there that some of you may not have had a chance to see. So I just want to mention them real real quickly. We have a food service worker at um, Sunset Ridge Elementary, Kathy O'Rourke. Kathy had an idea of starting a very small garden, getting kids involved and taking those, those vegetables, those garden products, and then serving them uh, during school lunches. Well, she wanted to expand that program, and so she um, applied for a grant. The grant was accepted, and now they have a very, very large garden. They have all kinds of kids involved, from the planting to the harvesting to the serving on the harvest barn, whatever. So, Kathy, uh, wherever you are, why don't you stand and, and be recognized. Thank you for being here this morning. I really appreciate that. And then you may have seen the Blue Valley West Jaguar um, mingling with you this morning. You'll remember a year ago, um, the Educational Foundation funded a North Mustang. And it, it's, it's a very special um, type of, of, a, uh, um, of a Mustang. And this is a very special type of Jaguar in that it's a sensory suit. And we have a very, very special group of young people that have the honor and the privilege of representing their school in these suits. So I think, Summer, are you here? And your parents, would you stand and be recognized for supporting the Blue Valley West Jag Jaguars this morning someplace back there? I, I think, I hope, maybe they slipped out already. Well, anyway, we really do want to share our appreciation to, to Summer for um, being here this morning. You know, you just have to love the theme, Welcome Home to Blue Valley. Whoever came up with that, um, it, it's just an outstanding theme. May or may not be aware, but I've actually lived in Johnson County for almost 60 years. And we go back, this is the home that we moved into in 1955. And yes, that's little Tommy Triggs tricycle. <laughs> right out there in front. Um, Lots of memories um, from those times growing up in Overland Park, quite frankly. Um, I remember, um, and some of you, maybe this will be a walk for you down memory lane, um, remember downtown Overland Park and really the hub was the Sears and Roebuck catalog store. Sunflower Drugs. Sunflower Drugs, I'd ride my bike downtown Overland Park and the reason you go to Sunflower Drugs is because they had the best baseball cards. You know, it was always a contest between Ben Franklin 5 and 10 and Shalinsky Drugs and Sunflower Drugs, and in, in my mind, Sunflower always won. They always had the best um, 
baseball carts, Red's Barbershop, fresh milk delivered to the home every day in glass bottles. I mean, that's, that's the reality of the way things were back then. So I have this, this, this feeling, I guess, that this um, um, relationship with this whole Johnson County area and in particular Blue Valley now, and this theme of home, I think, is really going to serve us well this morning because what we're going to do is we're going to take this theme and we're going to talk about five different characteristics that are so important to a happy, healthy home and a happy, healthy family. We're going to talk about identity. We're going to talk about commitment. We're going to talk about resilience, celebration, and appreciation. And throughout this morning, we're going to show a couple of videos that I think you'll find will be pretty touching that will help us to emphasize just what some of these characteristics mean um, to us. So 